Hey guys, what's going on? It's Grant from Grant and Shelby. Uh, here with a barbell box um, I got for the month of October. Really excited to open this one. You know, this is number two for October. I'm sorry it's so late. Um, I just got it. I was a little bit busy and couldn't get to it uh, on time. So this uh, box uh, is roughly around a $30 box per month. I think it's like 35 actually. It's probably my most expensive one, um, but it usually has the best amount of products, I think. Um, it has a lot of good uh, supplements and good products inside this box. So yeah, I'm really excited to, to try it out. Yeah, let's get it open. Here's what it currently looks like right now. So they have a little note again, looks like it's stamped on and then just written my name on it, just like last time. So, and here is also the sheet with everything inside of it. So yeah, let's get to it. Oh, cow, it's got a lot of stuff in here. Let's start off with one of the coolest ones out. Uh, that's really interesting. It has protein mac and cheese. With mac and cheese, you do get some protein into it, especially whenever you use milk. You don't really get a lot. This is really interesting, it's 20 grams per serving, so it's a good amount. There's a ton of stuff in here, but you know, it is uh, dried out, so it has a lot of sodium in it. Honestly, really excited to try it because of I love mac and cheese, and this is a great snack for you to do. Um, like I said, it's only, it, or it has 20 grams of protein. Really pumped to try it out. This is, I think, a multivitamin. Um, it says you take two daily, so my my assumption is that it is. Don't really know what it is. Yeah, that's that's interesting. I, I haven't seen that before. Awesome. This is so cool. Beef bites. So like little snacks of uh, lean protein. It looks like half a package is about 10 grams of protein. So I'm really excited to try this. It's just like beef jerky. Next up we have Grenade Cobb Killer, which is the cool Australian company that, that does some protein stuff. So you have two bars right there um, that they came out with, um, chocolate chip cookie dough and caramel chaos. I've had these in other boxes before. They're not bad. These actually look like they're bars and not like jumbled up and like half smushed and all that. So from the package. So that's really appreciated. Thank you. We've got a ton of whey protein, four packets of protein from SciTech Nutrition. They give you this strawberry white chocolate flavor. And in one scoop, you know, they have a ton of aminos in it, uh, 22 grams of protein. So it, it's a full whey protein compared to like an isolate or anything. So cool. Yeah, I like it. And last but not least, looks like we've got a shirt that says, once you hit the mirror, you can barely even see it on here. It says, you can go home now. That's, you know, whenever you're sweating, you can, you can start seeing these. Interesting, interesting. Not really sure how I feel about it. It looks like a standard cotton shirt, 90% cotton, 10% polyester. So this, this sucker will shrink. So looking at it, it fits great right now, but I feel like it's going to change a little bit later. The print is a little weird. Whenever you see yourself in the mirror, you know, you can see this and everything. Um, you know, just like with every other shirt right here in my in my arms, it's a little bit tight. Uh, my shoulders aren't tight, nor my chest. My chest is very, very open, which is great. But again, just my, just my arms, which kind of sucks. Other than that, you know, it feels pretty good. It's a cotton shirt, so it's going to feel good. Let me go through everything what's in here. Sweet Chili Heat beef bites. They're roughly around $9 Canadian. The US, my guess would be like, I'm gonna guess like six. Mac and cheese is $3 Canadian, but if we look at it, you know, US, I'm gonna guess two. Protein you get right here, all those packets, four packets. They're saying it's $10 Canadian. So let's bump it down to probably an eight for, for four scoops. That's probably a good amount. The shirt. It says it's $35 Canadian. I don't really think that that's the case. I think it's probably like a maybe $20 shirt. Um, I will say that this cotton feels a little bit better compared to others, so these are 10, right? I'm gonna guess like six. This sucker, which they're valuing it as $45 Canadian, um, which I'm not Canadian at all, so um, looking at the US side, um, my guess is 25 to 30 per se. Okay, so this is like a sleep fat burning pill, which I don't know how I feel about that, to be honest. I get why people say, you know, use these whenever you're falling asleep to lose weight and gain muscle and all this other stuff. But one, I don't need help doing that, especially like this. I'm not really a huge fan of that. Um, this actually really sets me back off of my barbell box compared to what the other stuff they've given me. Not a huge fan of this because 
of I don't supplement my sleep on top of that. I mean, I'm all, I'm I'm a 25 year old, so burning fat is already easy for me to do. I don't need a supplement to assist me or possibly carry my body to burn more fat, you know? Or even just get to sleep. Like, yeah, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. So, looking at this box all together, I mean, it's about roughly around the supplements themselves. You already set, uh, set it closer to a $50 amount for this box. So, I mean, it definitely, you know, you, you get your money's worth for it. What do I think about this box? It was okay. I really like the muscle mac and cheese. I'm not a huge fan of the shirt, but you know, I'll still wear it. I like the protein bars. I like that mix there. I like the whey protein. The thing that really deterred me, man, was the sleep supplement. I'm just not a fan of that at all. Now, you know, if you are in your 30s and 40s and you have trouble sleeping or you have trouble working out and say, for instance, you only have that hour, hour and a half right after work to work out and it may be seven or eight o'clock and you can't fall asleep at like nine or 10, then yeah, maybe this would be something, some sort of supplement. But again, I would look really into the ingredients and try to figure out exactly what's in it because uh, there are a ton of multivitamins. There are a ton of other things out there that can kill you compared to helping you. what you guys think about the box? Did you guys like it? Did you hate it? Do you have any questions about these products? Please put them in the comments down below. And if you haven't, please like and subscribe. Yeah, this has been Barbell Box for October 2018. Thank you so much for watching.